Yeah, so thank you. Thank you to everyone. Thank you to everyone. You now know who the biggest fan base is, right? You guys know who the biggest fan, is, fan base is. I hope you guys know who the biggest fan base is because it's so obvious now. <laughs> but yeah, guys, um, thank you so much to everyone who has voted for me and who's voted for Kaya, who has voted for McJunior. I'm really, really, really happy and I'm proud um, to call you guys my fans. So thank you so much. Highly deserved. Thank you to everybody that supported Mac Jr. man. Thank you to every single one of y'all. I don't know what y'all saw, but yo, thank you to every single person, man. The real Kachamba in the building, my dog. The real Kachamba. Thank y'all. He came, he saw, he conquered. His name is Tepacho AK. Hello, you all. We all know Mac Jr. is the winner of the two million runs, right? Mac Jr. won the Big Brother Zamzi season four. And there were some reactions by the housemates, family members, fans after he won the show. So we are here to talk about some of them. I'm going to start with the first clip you guys watched. That is Lima. So after the winner was announced, which is Mac Jr., Lima went on live and she was like saying, oh, we all know who the biggest fan base is now. We all know who the biggest fan base is, right? We all know yada, yada, yada. Guys, you all, you've watched the clip. You've heard what she said from her own mouth. Then she went ahead to thank the people that voted for her, voted for uh, Mac Jr. and all. So this particular video got people talking. They said, why would Lima go live and say that kind of thing? Why would she say, you all know who the biggest fan base is? And when people were saying that, I understand them, yeah? I understand where they are coming from because now Lima is making it look like our fans made Mac Jr. win, which I know, yeah, they contributed to his win and all. But if I were to be honest, yeah, Mac Jr. already had fans in the house. Mac Jr. and Mac KK, they already had fans. If you remember, while Lima was still in the house, like, the earlier stage of the game, our fans were not voting for Mac Jr. And Mac Jr. was always saved whenever he is nominated, including Mac KK, right? But let's just focus on Mac Jr. for now. Mac Jr. was nominated several times in the house and his own fans voted for him. He was saved. Lyman fans only started voting for him when Lyman left the ass. And we all know before she left the ass, they were very, very close, like super, super close and all. So that live video she made, that what she said, made it look like her fans made Mac Jr. win. Like, I know, fine, her fans contributed to his win, but it was making it sound like, she was making it sound like our fans did all the work like Mac Jr. doesn't have any fan base our fans voted for him like the entire time which is not true she did not say that though but as saying we all know who the biggest fan base is right we all know who the biggest fan base is now repeatedly like she was saying it continuously we all know who the biggest fan base is now and I don't know from my own point of view I think she's trying to shade someone People were saying, oh, she's, she wants to take all the glory. She's making it look like um, her fans, only her fans voted for Mark Jr. No, Mark has, he had his own fans and all, which I explained earlier what people were saying in the comment section. But I was not looking at it from that angle. To me, I think she was trying to shade someone. And we all know who that is. Obviously, Yolanda yes because we all know right from the beginning we knew mac jr or makeke would win the show and when lima was outside she was campaigning for mac jr while yolanda was campaigning for makeke i even said it before the end of the show and everything i said if mac jr wins it will look like lima has more fans than yolanda and if uh, makeke wins it would look like 
Yolanda has more fans than Lima because obviously Yolanda fans they said they are voting for Makeke they want him to win like they are just trying to support their gear because they are close because Yolanda is like campaigning for him Lima fans on the other hand they said they want Mark Jr to win because they are supporting their favorite Lima and everything so the show was like between Lima fans and Yolanda's fans, though Lima and Yolanda they are cool, then Makeke and Mark Jr. Right? We all know that. But Lima was not supposed to come out and say it to people's faces, saying we all know who the biggest fan base is now. We all know who the biggest fan base is. She's indirectly saying she has more fans than Yolanda. That is, if Yolanda and her didn't leave the ass on time, if they had stayed to the final, she would have won the show. Because obviously for Mark Jr. to win means she has more fans than Yolanda. That is what I saw in that video. That live video she made. The words she said that that is what I saw in it. And another thing I was thinking about, another thing I saw there is that, girl, you are too quick. Lima was just too quick. The show just like, they just announced the winner and she went on live saying that, I said I doubt if this girl knows the percentage, the voting percentage, because Mark Jr. won Makeke, right? Mark Jr. had 34.50% vote, while Makeke had 34.43% vote. We can see the difference. We can see the difference, yeah? So she's saying she now has the biggest fan base because Mark Jr. won. And they were literally like, same percentage like same percentage so i believe she did not see the voting pool before making that video that is just by the way right and i'm still going to talk about another video i saw yeah where jared was interviewed and when he was asked if he still has anything to do with lima he said no that they have nothing they can be friends right they can just be cordial, but no like relationship there, yada, 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 and all that. Which Lima also said on stage that no, they have nothing, nothing. When she was on stage, she said that Upumi even said the same thing that she and Jerry is like cancelled, nothing that it doesn't deserve. Ah, uh, it doesn't deserve Lima. I was like, Upumi, can you speak for yourself, girl? Speak for yourself. Beside you, force yourself in that triangle jerry did not force her so that's just it and lima and jerry they were spotted in the all-white party after the show jerry was beside her he was doing his thing lima was doing her thing they ignored each other completely you all these two people they literally ignored each other i was like yo jerry you were there in an interview saying you guys can be friends or cordial, but the way it is going, I'm not sure there will be even friendship there. There won't be any friendship because they are like ignoring each other. You give me this energy, I reciprocate the energy. It's sap. So it's giving no friendship. Lima and uh, Jerry is giving no friendship, no cordial relationship whatsoever, no relationship, nothing, nothing. Then we also saw a video of Mark Jr. appreciating his fans. Like he was just giving appreciation speech, saying he doesn't know what they saw in him that they had, that they took it upon themselves to vote for him. He's grateful, he's thankful, and all that. Just appreciating his fans, thanking his fans, smiling so hard and all short and cute speech oh and i'm still going to talk about this interesting video i saw guys yesterday during the live uh, show yeah i was too invested in wanting to know the winner that i forgot a particular thing that happened now i'm going to bring it to you guys notice you've seen the clip right makeke was literally flying you guys makeke before the winner was announced during the live show, Makeke was flying. You know, he invented that English when he had an issue with Papa Ghost and he was telling Papa Ghost that Papa Ghost is flying. It's like, Papa Ghost is being too forward. This guy took it upon himself. Makeke took it upon himself to be flying. He was literally flying. <laughs> Guys, 
before they both went out on the stage he had a lot to drink to be honest he had a bottle of wine in his hands and um, he was drinking he drank a lot but alcohol is not is no excuse it is no excuse right from the time they were coming on stage like guys did you see how he slightly pushed mac jr and just went past like mm, you have to slow leave the way i'm the winner let me it that that is what the, that is what that video gave me like leave the way you are too slow you are not even the winner let the winner go forward i was like makeke yo you have not even won the money and his true color is already coming at the way he just slightly used his hand and removed mac jr from the way he just went forward and he was already shaking the crowd giving handshakes here and there he was just so excited behaving like oh i already know i'm going to win i already know i'm going to win oh it was just too forward it was just flying it was just too flying so that's just it guys please subscribe to my channel subscribe and please 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 like this video click on the like button also comment and share thank you